Visco. Hello everyone. Welcome to this tutorial on how to set up face recognition using the Head Vision CCTV system. In this video, I am going to use a few items for configurations. The first item will be the 7732 NSII4 which is a 32 channel 1U AccuSense of 4K MBR. So this MBR has a smart feature which is called facial recognition and he can do the face picture comparisons, face capture and the face picture search. So with the library, he can use up to 16 face picture libraries with a total of 10,000 faces pictures. So the MVR itself can do the 4 channel face picture comparisons that capture from camera and can done the 1 channel human face capture for the HD network camera up to 4 MP. So the second item we use is the normal 2CD10430 which is a normal 4 MP fixed bullet network camera for face capture. So this is another MVR model called 7732 NSIK4. So this MVR is currently a stock model of Visco, but this item is not available here. So I will use the 7732 NSI i4 that I have in for just now for the setup part. But this K4 model will also offer the same features and similar settings, including the facial recognition here. So it has the face picture comparison, human face capture, and also the face picture search. He has also the face library and up to one channel uh, for MP face capture and four channel face picture comparisons. So now let us moving to the next tutorial part. So before we proceed to the setup part, let us know about the simple algorithm of the facial recognition. So the first part is the face capture. The face capture will be done by the cameras which the cameras will capture the images of faces within its view. And then the capture faces will come back again in the face library, which is known as a database of known faces to identify or verify individuals. And this can be done either within the camera or by the MVR. So as we know, there are three ways to set up face recognition with hit vision products. So the first option is without the MVR. Just using a 7 series standalone camera with an SD card for the library. And the second will be a camera support the face captures and the MVR that supports the face comparisons. And the third will be any camera with the MVR that supports for both face capture and face comparisons. So the difference between these three options is the first option is using a standalone camera for both face capture and face comparisons with a built-in face library that stored in the SD card in the camera. So the method is simple but has a drawback, which the face library is independent and confined to the camera, making it harder for manage the larger setups. So the second method is the method where the camera will be capture faces and send the images to the MVR for the comparisons. This setup can support more channels, making it suitable for larger installations but it might be a bit costly for small projects due to the higher specifications required for the camera. And for the third option is MVR performing the both the capture and comparison tasks with any camera. This option is cost effective, especially for smaller scale projects like FR projects using below the 16 channels because it allows the uh, use of any existing or low-end cameras. And in this video, we will be using the third option to configure the facial recognition. So now we're going to the setup part of the face recognition. So here is the interface of the Pro Series 7732 and SIMVR web page. So we have added the 1 Series 1043 cameras inside the MVR. The first step we need to do is go to the face picture libraries and to click the add button for the face picture library. For example, I'm going to do a company here. And we go inside the company, we can add the face of the members and the name of the members. So we can also provide the other info like gender, date of birth and contact information here. So for me, I have already set a face picture uh, libraries, which uh, one of my member, Jeremy's, will, will be used for the demo parts. So the next step is we going to the face capture under the VCA, and then we can select the camera we want to face capture over here and using the setting, like army schedule, linkage method, and some advanced parameter like sensitivity, and the picture quality. After we setting up all the things and then we can click the save here. 
So now the face capture already enabled to the camera we select. So the last step is we going to the face picture comparisons under the event. And then we can enable for the selected cameras. And then we can click like prompt for the few face comparison and the successful face picture. Some, something like the face when detected is not matched, we will come out the strangers. And when match is the welcome. So for here, the army schedules and also linkage method for face match and also fail match, we can also setting for the part. And last part, we go to the link face picture category and we select the demo. And then uh, we can also uh, adjust the similarity for the face match setting. So after done all the setting, we can click the save here. And now we are done for the setting. For face recognition so over the rule configuration here the minimum people distance is important that referring to the minimum distance between the people of, of a face that the system needs to be detected so you can use a default or for example you can draw an area using the minimum people distance uh, setting here and then you draw the eyes to eyes of a face and then you click the save and this setting will help the MVR filter out face that are too small or too far away, improving the overall effectiveness of the facial recognition setup. And that's it. You are successfully set up face recognition using 7732 NSI NVR with a 1043 camera. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next video. Visco.